So, what's this very special favor you want me to do? Assist Dr. Nance in Matthew's surgery. I'm not asking you to operate. What do you think assist means? I just want you to observe him, make sure he's doing it right. Oh, he'll love that. You said you taught him the procedure. I can't see him objecting. Oh, and once I get into the operating room, I won't be able to resist. No, I told you. I don't expect you to operate. Tie your hands behind your back for all I care. You're serious? I just want you there, in case something goes wrong. Oh, and what if something does go wrong? You're not responsible. <sighs> because you say so. Because you didn't perform the surgery. You're just, you're lending your expertise. No, my expertise is what hurt Sean in the first place. You used all of your knowledge and training to save his life. Yeah, and something went real wrong. Do you know how difficult it is living with this? And if something happened to your brother, then... What if something happens and you're not there? Look, I'm not God! You said it yourself, God is only 50%. Do you really think that I can prevent something bad from happening? Not if you're not there. You can't come with me to Seattle. Why not? Uh, we have a math test tomorrow. I can make it up. I have like a 97%. Well, I don't have enough money for two tickets. I can buy my own. You think only people with trust funds can fly? I'm just saying, it's really expensive. I have money saved up. Well, what about Sean? Don't you want to be here in case he wakes up? I'll leave him a note. He'll understand. A note saying that you chose me over him. Since when do you argue this much? I'm not. It's just I know how much you care about Sean. I mean, I love my brother, but I... <laughs> Hey, Matthew. <clears throat> Hi, Deb. Hi. Can we talk to you for a sec? Why? Look, I'm not trying to be a jerk, but I have nothing else to say. Well, then maybe you'd just listen to us for a while. Well, I'm not going to change my mind. No, <laughs> you've convinced us of that. So then what? Well, your father and I have been discussing your surgery, and we've decided we're not going to fight you anymore. But I feel responsible for mine. So now you want me to put myself in a position that you know I'd be uncomfortable with. For you. For Matthew. But I'd be doing the favor for you. If that's what will persuade you to observe in Matthew's surgery, then yes. Do it for me. I'm sorry. It's... It's all right. No, you don't owe me anything. My brother's in love with you. Then do it for him. If that's what you think he would want. Just be there. Please. So you guys are serious? You're really not going to fight me anymore? Nope, we've talked about it. We figure that you've got enough to worry about tomorrow. Yeah, tell me about it. So we figured tonight we just get ready. Does that mean you guys are coming with me to Seattle? Mm, actually, you're coming with us. We're going to take the Buchanan Enterprises jet. Does that sound okay? Sounds great. Well, 